The C. Turini Claudio SRL has its head office in Villafranca di Verona, Northern Italy. Our company is specialized in the manufacturing of settling systems which recycle wastewater produced during the glass, marble, granite and concrete processing. Thanks to a wide range of products and an accurate consultancy activity, a leading position on the national and international markets since early 80s. All our systems can in fact meet the requirements of small, medium and large companies. Our systems are extremely advanced and in line with the strictest European standards. A fundamental component of glass processing is the utilization of water. Currently, almost all glass processing plants make use of a sophisticated and automated system. During the beveling of ages, water acts as lubricant and coolant for the tools used, whilst at the same time rinsing away any residual material, very fine powder. The same method is adopted for shaped glass and drilling. The water is collected into a central well using a network of small length tanks and drainage pipes. Alternatively, the water can be collected from the surface through a separate system of pipes. Discarded material such as dust from glass, packaging and other tailings settle into a central well. In these tanks there is a submerged lifting pump for dirty waters. This pump drives the wastewater into the settled silos working together with a flocculating pump. The purpose of the flocculating pump is that of mixing the wastewater with a chemical product at very low concentration which can separate the dust from the water by turning the former into heavy flakes. The pump also prevents the solidification of mud deposits at the cone base and on the surface. By adequately controlling the flocculating pump it is possible to obtain the required level of water clearness. The water is drained into a storage tank through a connecting pipe. Within the tank the wastewater is filtered in order to keep discarded material. If the storage tank is not available, a manual release filter can be used instead. Two level fillers control the complete water cycle. A longer filler activates the submerged lifting pump as well as the flocculating pump. A shorter one is in contact with the water and can stop the whole system. pH control and stabilization is also performed in order to avoid future corrosion of old equipment. From the pumping station, the clear water is sent back to the work cycle with a pressure which varies from 2 to 3 bars. The system is indeed equipped with two pumps, one in operation and the other one as backup. As an alternative to so-called cylindrical systems illustrated so far, there are so-called rectangular systems. They have the same function as the cylindrical ones but occupy less room because are equipped with a lamellar device which speeds up the settling process. All systems are equipped with valves. A command valve can be operated by a discharge timer or manually. At the end of the cycle the mud is collected into sacks 
which retain the dust but let the water flow back into the system.